Acid Music Studio is a loop-based music production program that will enable you to compose and create your own music. This video will provide you with a brief overview of how to work with Acid zip files containing preloaded loops. Working with audio editing software often involves multiple files. There is usually a project file in which all the work takes place, and this file creates links to separate media files. In Acid Music Studio, you have the option to save your projects as ACID zip files, which results in one file that contains both the project information and the media files required for that project. Upon opening an ACID zip file with preloaded loops, you will see that there are already a number of tracks loaded into the project, and some of these tracks may already be in use. Before we start adding our own contributions, we're going to check the grid spacing of the timeline. The timeline is divided up into small segments, and the size of these segments is controlled by selecting Options and then Grid Spacing. When working with Harmony elements, you'll likely want your grid spacing to be larger, measure or half notes. We'll work with measure, which is another word for bar. While you're in Options, you should also check that Snapping is enabled. Now we can start drawing where we want the loops to play in the timeline using the Draw tool represented by the pencil icon in the toolbar. With snapping enabled, you can click and drag slightly to draw in a single bar, or drag over multiple bars to add the same loop for a longer duration. Once you have drawn a loop, you can click and drag the edges on either side to make it longer or shorter. To delete, click on a loop event to select it and press delete on your keyboard. At any time, you can play what has been entered using the buttons at the bottom of the timeline. 